Cześć, witam was bardzo serdecznie, z tej strony Hubianko, to jest The Walking Dead, sezon drugi, epizod trzeci. Idziemy do Billa, porozmawiać z nim, podobno chce się z nami widzieć. Rebecca! She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Get in here. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will. And weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. You have to be able to contribute. I understand. I knew you were a smart girl. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I know. I have to do everything for them. It's exhausting. Of course it is. But that's the role you're meant to play. And we're more alike. Tak chcę się zachowywać. Chcę mu w dupę wchodzić. Ale tak naprawdę nie jest. Ja, ja chcę, żeby on zginął. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way, the way my child will be raised. It ain't this hurt that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. I'll help you, whatever you need. I know I'm just a kid, but I'll do my best. Well, that's all I can ask. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Dobra. Może przez ten sposób, że tak trochę mu ubóstwiamy. O, czyhacze. Tak mu po prostu chodzimy w dupę, jak powiedziałem. Może uda się przez to po prostu yy, zdobyć tą krótkofalówkę. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just got to figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Kenny, do not speak to me like that. Sound draws walkers. There was this girl, Molly. She used bells to control where they moved. Yeah, that's right. She had them running all over Crawford. We just need something loud. Well, unless you've got a megaphone tucked in your pocket, it doesn't help us much now. I still vote we get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Oh, come on. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? Look, Clem had it right. We just need something loud to get their attention. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building. 
pointed toward the parking lot. I saw him when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. There are few along the roof. He's right. I saw them too. Really? It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Kenny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. We should get the radio to Luke. It doesn't hurt to have more information. I agree. Fine, fine. We can do that. But the herd is still what's gonna get us out of here. Maybe Luke can tell us where it's hitting from. Okay, so we get that turd radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. First words I ever hear you say and it's just some crazy stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. I can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. You seem to know what you're talking about. I've done it too. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Dobra. No to chyba wszystko zaczyna się układać. Fajnie to wygląda. Kurde no. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Don't let go. I got you. Dobra, no to Gina. Mam nadzieję, że się uda, bo... Nie no... Według mnie pan jest świetny. Kurde... I o ile ich tam jest? Kurde no, jest nieźle. O, strażnicy. Tego mogłem się spodziewać w sumie. Nie możemy się gdzieś ukryć? Tu możemy. Dobra, to idźmy tam. So you're not sure? What about how many there are? Yeah. No doubt. Okay. I hope they pass by us. God, yeah. 
Are we based? Mamy przerąbane. O nie, o nie, o nie, o nie. Chociaż ona może nam pomóc. Ona jest w miarę fajna. O, tak. Dobra. Teraz tutaj, tak? So really, no bullshit. You think we're ready? Dalej. Ok. Okay, udało się. O, świetnie. I co jest? Jakam to złapać? Aha, dobra, dobra, rozumiem. Tak. Dobra, dwie mogą być. Wiem. Czyż mu się udało? Nie, on nas zobaczy, zobaczy nas. You can't be smoking back here. Vince, come on. Don't give me that. If Bill smells a whiff of smoke back here, he'll flip. What are you thinking? You know what? I'm just gonna tell him. I'm not letting someone else get blamed for this. That's bullshit. Vince! Vince, come on! Vince! Dobra, udało się. Kurde, no. Nie spodziewałem się, że nas nie zobaczy. Byłem przekonany, że on to zobaczy. Oh. Dobra, fajnie. Świetnie się udało. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. Musisz mnie złapać, bo jak nie. We best get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well? Ciekawe gdzie schowała te dwie. No need drawn suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Thanks. Yep. Anyway, get some rest. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Kid was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he'd just run. He couldn't stop him. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. Dobrze moi drodzy, w dzisiejszym odcinku było na tyle. Ja się z wami żegnam. Na razie. Cześć.